Hi friends, I'm Explore with Shani and I just moved my dog Atlas and my cat Ranger into my car to explore the world. From the desert to the mountaintops, the world is our new adventure and we are inviting you to come along. Let's have some fun. I have a whole week trip planned. It's gonna be super exciting. But to start out this morning, my car battery was dead. And no one better than two Idaho boys, men, helped me out. You know what? Idaho men never cease to amaze me. Super thankful for you guys and excited to get on the road and get this party started. But first, laundry time. Laundry time. Yes, it is. All right, before we go on our crazy trip, we have to go grocery shopping. And I gotta hurry because it's pretty toasty outside. So literally 10 minute grocery shopping. Let's go. And we are out of our comfort zone completely, but we are shipping. Perfect. Guys, this is bad. This is so bad for me right now. This isn't going well, guys. That was a crazy market. Got back in time. It's not too hot in the car. That's great. And now time for a shower. The shower is fine. The shower is scrumptious. It's like paying for that extra salt that they find in the middle of the earth. It's amazing. I see an arch. I see an arch. Do you see the arch like I do? After all that work, I need a hamburger. <laughs> I haven't had one in forever. This is bacon. Of course. Look at it. Just. Mm, it, oh. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> it's a bit windy. I'm already in my sweats. Um, but this is a great overnight location. This is not like a place you, where you camp. This is just like pulling off and there's a dirt road, but it's BLM. So you can at least camp here overnight and you, no one will come and knock on your door. So yeah, a lot of the times it's about being flexible and just seeing what opportunity opens up. Oh, I just fed Atlas. You love it? Good. And I'm rearranging and I'm making sure that stuff's on top of the roof, easy to put in the car, but also I'm gonna move some to under the car because it might rain. There's no telling. Good morning. It's time for coffee. <laughs> we woke up to coyotes screaming. Um, yeah. So we're gonna head in town, get a plan together, and head off to our next campsite. Exciting. It's okay. You're safe with mom. You're safe in the car. The coyotes aren't gonna get you. It's almost time to get up. Good morning, boo-boo. <laughs> Ranger did not want to go outside um, at all this morning after hearing the coyotes. So that's perfect for me because he wanted to wander so much in the last location. It was really hard to find him. But he always came back. But at the same time, I was like, he likes it too much here. So, yay. He loves to be in the car again. Guys, it's so cute in Blanding, Utah. So cute. So I just stopped at Destination Await Coffee and Blanding. And I got me a latte. And I got me an egg potato burrito. Really excited about that. Um, and then I also, she threw in an extra donut. <laughs> I don't need an extra donut. But a chocolate donut. Um, I'm not gonna eat it right now, but um, it's a bakery as well. So I'm really excited to try it. So first, coffee first, of course. Oh God, that is, that is a really good half sweet honey latte. Oh man, that's really good with regular milk. And then let's try the burrito. Eggs are my favorite food. Something about me, eggs are my favorite food. So I love trying food in different places too. Oh, it's hot, caliente, here we go. So I just checked and there's a thrift store. 
here, so I might do my next thread. Also, are we about to go look at some artifacts after I change because I am melting? Um, yeah, on the way to the campsite, yeah, we're gonna do it. And Atlas can go out on a couple of those trails. So yeah, we're gonna go acting time. Eight dollars for a bag of clothes. Let's freaking go. Gone thrifting, yeah, baby. The Dustin the owner. Hello. Gone thrifting. <laughs> That's okay, he's gonna get one after talking to me. <laughs> Stin is the best. We got, we got so many banties coming your way. Actually, they're probably already posted and half sold. So, Shani's Vintage, Instagram. He's gonna get an Instagram. Gone thrifting. Eight dollar bag sell or whatever sell it is that week. Don't miss out. We're having a blast. Woo! Now we are on our way to the campsite. The babies are ready to go and roam around. I also got Ranger a color with a bell because we are in a major big predatory area. And so, yeah, I need to know where he is. So we are on a trail, the only trail pretty much that Atlas can go on. It's an interpretive trail. And so it's a nice little break, little walk before we get to our campsite ancient artifacts, homes in the caves, in the rocks, super cool. And doggies must be on leashes no matter what, 100%. Super cool. Let's go. Just how freaking cool. Super cool, super fun. Headed back to the car. How freaking cool, guys! It's so cool, I love it all the time. It's so cool, everybody loves it. Bro, when you see this camp, when you see the Do you love it, Ranger? Do you love it? Maybe great for exploring for a couple days? Yes. Happy bump. <laughs> so I think I'm actually gonna move over to this side because I have these, I have this, uh, these trees here. I'm more hidden. I'm not in the main road. The animals aren't right next to the road. And oh my god, I'm gonna get on top of that! Let's appreciate the scenery one more time before I set up camp. Full of carbs now and ready to explore. Ready to I'm planning on actually going to the visitor center tomorrow. So I need to explore this today. It's an exploring party. Where's he at? There he is. exploring stops here. Yeah? You don't want to go any further? Okay, Atlas. You done, bud? Also, another one of my reasons that I do this is to check and see what wildlife is around with the scat. So, so far, just mule deer. I made me a PBJ to have for dinner and uh, have my hot tea and I have some jam cookies that have me in the chokehold. Uh, it's a problem. And then I'm playing fetch with my boy. This is a really pretty campsite. However, I'm kind of close to the road and I have to keep watching Ranger. 
So I think this is like a one or two night location for me personally. Um, tomorrow I'm going to go to the visitor center, do a couple hikes with Atlas if he can. I think he can. And then I think I'll stay another night, one more night, and then I'm going to go to the next location because super pretty just stresses me out with this feline who, you know what, does not want to stay out of the road at all. You know you do. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching. Thanks for being clever. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning. We're going to cuddle a little more and get up, eat some breakfast, and head to the visitor center and see what we can do today. Isn't that right? Good morning, Katie. <laughs> All right, so the place I was going to go, it's kind of expensive and meaning it's pretty much like a national park. Um, oh, it is a national park. <laughs> so he can't even hike. I don't even know. Okay, well, eh, rookie mistake. However, I'm going to drive into service and I'm going to find a local trail where he can hike. So we'll go do that and then we'll head back to camp and explore and maybe take some shots for the next Shani's Vintage launch. So just going with the flow. I just don't think it's worth it if Atlas can't freaking just be outside with me. Atlas is so excited. He's like running. Okay, I just jinked us. It's really cool though. This is so cool. I get to enjoy this on the hike. I love it. We are really hydrated, but I love when there's water on the trail unexpectedly. Here is House on Fire, right here. Um, I don't know why it's called that, so if you do, and you are a history buff, tell me in the comments below. Nope. Nope. It's a bear. <laughs> I was like, why is this rock called a house? <laughs> Here is the House on Fire. Super cool. Better video. And don't take dogs up there. Um, be respectful of the BLM and of our history, but yeah, super, super cool. And just exploring now. I love it. Super cool hike, super cool place. We're going to head back to the car so Ranger can explore now. We took a little slot canyon on the way out, and yes, we love it. All right, change of plans. Um, it is, it possibly might rain and I'm in flash flood area. So that's a no. And then also, I uh, it, there's 18 mile per hour winds tonight. Temperature's dropping over 10 degrees. And you know what? Tonight we're getting a hotel. A motel, it's not, I'm not, it's not gonna be fancy, but tonight's the night. We're going to do it. This is one of those nights where I'm like calling it. I'm going to drive to a motel and we're going to stay there tonight because I just don't have the energy just to go look for another campsite that's not in flash flood. So, but yeah, it's part of the experience. So we are in the hotel. I had the most amazing bath shower. I'm going to have another bath shower. <laughs> oh, wow. It's crazy. But Ranger, I really like going to go to bed early, but anyways, you guys are awesome. See you later. So we're all getting packed up and going to head to a small town for dinner. It's a really cute town. And then I think I'm going to head back out into the wilderness. Eating my breakfast. Got some Maverick breakfast, which is actually not bad. It's better than a lot of our breakfasts. Um, me and this guy are fighting. He tried to rip off my mesh uh, window covers. So, yeah. 
Um, I'm having to break his little feral spirit right now, but it's for our good, trust me. My rage is about to, let me tell you what's really hard in this lifestyle. A cat is really hard. Alice is the sweet baby angel. A cat is really hard. Atlas is the sweetest babyest angel ever. He's the sweetest baby angel, baby angel. Fun tip, Southeast Utah, when it rains or snows um, on these roads, you can get heavily stuck. It's like sinking sand pretty much and gets up all up in your tires. So we might not be uh, camping in the place I wanted to, it's 36 degrees, so it will drop in the teens as well. And I was just here yesterday and it was in the 60s, so you never know what you're gonna get. Always have to learn to go with the flow. So we might be going north. Love it. the wind calms down but yeah so now what I have to do is I have to um, get the ice in the ice chest and then I gotta shake out the bed so gotta do that There's definitely going to be a part two to the amazing highway of Utah. So this is part one. Tonight I'm going to make ramen and show you how I make my ramen. And I'm going to try some new dessert like these, um, what are they, boba tea mochi? And then also like these little pokey, oh, I forgot what they're called. Date on irritations. The hands do not uh, itch or hurt anymore, but I have a current agitation, irritation in my eyelid. Are you serious right now? Oh, he literally complained and caused so much trouble today on the way here because he wanted out of the car. And this is, are you kidding? It's starting to snow. <laughs> We don't have to pick up and move. So I checked out a lot of the other campsites down the road and the wind hits them the exact same way. Actually, mine's the best one so far, which is kind of crazy to me. 
we took a much needed rest and now You want to go make some dinner? Yeah? Taste? Oh, keep running into this. The wind was my nemesis today. Here we go. It's time for weird snacks with Jenny. Okay, so this. Here, in the face, here. This is a bubble tea. Uh, mochi. Mochi. I don't know. How do you say it? But. Anyways, squishy. I like it, but it's weird. <laughs> weird snacks. Anyways. Now, I love banana everything, so banana cream covered cocoa biscuit stacks, hockey. It's like, it's like this is a pretzel. <laughs> they were trying to make it chocolate. And I prefer the strawberry. Not my favorite, but this isn't bad. Bring it back. Bring it back. Well, I think I'm gonna call it a day. Uh, with some interesting snacks for sure. But I'll see you guys tomorrow on our last little hike because we always have to end on a hike or hi. <laughs> Anyways, actually, we're going to go on a little adventure right now. And that's a wrap for this week. If you like my content, don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, share, and you can join my Patreon as low as $3 a month. Thank you for being here. I love you. Gonna get on top of it. Oh, we're gonna. But why is this so good?
Why is this so good raw? Why? The girl is sleepy. She's a sleepy girl. She's a sleepy girl. Sleepy. Is that what it's called? <laughs> I have no idea.